Yo, I've got sub tears. Okay, hold on, hold on. Nah, 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 nah. I've got sub tears. That's where we're going next. I didn't even realize I had sub tears on here. Bro, I love sub tears. That's a great deck to start with. I know that I've completely changed course here. <laughs> Almost entirely. What what do we get? If, if we get if we get Bujins, if we get Bujins, of course we're gonna take a look at that. But like I feel like it makes sense to go down a road that I understand and know to a degree, right? These are some good pulls as well for sub-terrors, I think, right? I quite like the sub-terror archetype. What is AI omniscience? I don't I don't know. The problem is I don't know what it would be called a Bujin a Bujin pack. What is this? What is it? What's in here? Um I don't recognize you, Cybers. Okay, so you're not what I'm here for then. Um, what else? I This must be watching me go through this. I might have just glanced past some amazing stuff. And you might be screaming at your screen, but I can't hear you. Why are you doing that? That's not how, that's not how video recordings work. What's, what's wrong with you? Anyway, um, back to what I was doing, I guess. I guess I just, we just we, we keep on going in here. We keep on going in here and see what we get at, at the end of the day right more glowing things now ooh, what is this another okay another secret pack cool 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 your 10 person has no ur so I'll, i'm guaranteed a ur i so i got shafted is what you're trying to tell me Ooh, sub terror name okay so he's an sr i'm gonna need three copies of him i need three how how do i do i have any yet no i don't it says new that's how new things work all right we keep going one more time for the one more time a guaranteed a guaranteed you are here a guaranteed you are here we got two you are all right beautiful I right, what what do we get what do, ooh wait exodia the forbidden one i can make exodia i uh, you know uh, oh yeah obviously they, they said that you could they, they said that you could obviously you can um i already have one of these actually rank up magic i need to learn what that does so okay this is cool this i think is really really good I'm liking what I'm getting, but I know that I need more, and I still don't see anything for Bujins, bro. Why is this happening to me? So over the course of this, I think we completed a couple of missions. Um, oh, unlimited missions. How many gems do we get? Give me some gems. Okay, a thousand. That's actually a ten pull. We we got a ten pull. Thank you kindly. Thank you kindly for that, good sir. Right? We got enough for a whole ten pull. So let's do that real quick. Um, and then we can actually try and like build off of what we've gotten so far So I think I understand how the system works now I think I have a, a degree of an understanding even if I don't necessarily understand what's good and what's bad I'm just gonna go with what's familiar because that that that's who I am on the inside, right? Um, so no no luck with the Bujins, but at least I understand what I'm doing and how I got here is the most important thing um, a new card pack. Thank you kindly um did i i still i don't have any i was hoping to get more copies of warrior i'll be honest um sub nemesis warrior is what i was really hoping to get i'll keep it a buck but these are some again these are some okay pulls i think it's really hard to know what's good and what's bad when you've never played when you've never played the game like this before right let's just do some one pulls let's just do some one-offs i don't think there's a special benefit that i oh a special benefit that i get from doing like a big a big bunch at once right um something glowed i could have sworn i had an sr i could have sworn i had an sr okay never mind never mind i don't know why it glows sometimes and why it doesn't other times like it's glowing here maybe i don't have an sr okay i did that time but i've already got like five of those the benefit that i but one thing that i do know is with the crafting system with the crafting system i will be able to change course and deviate and get other things that i want in exchange for the things that i have that are just garbage to me right so i'm not too that, that that's why i'm not too fussed about anything right now again all of this could be a completely incorrect way of looking at the game and how it works this is day one maybe i should slow down but i'm dumb a little so here we are <laughs> <laughs> right we're just gonna we're just oh i know that i i know the guru is important i've never i've never been able to play with it because again i i do links right um but i know that guru is important for sub so that's actually really really cool that's a really good pull um ooh, what is this who are you you know what it doesn't really matter we're gonna keep on going we're just gonna keep on going without stopping to think for a little while this is our last pack for a bit and i think this is where we end right Okay, so we didn't get anything special. That's absolutely fine. Let's actually try and build a deck out of what we've got. So, Sub Terror. Let's see how many things we've got. So, I have got, huh, Behemoth Fiend. Are these the same thing? 
these look like the same thing so why are they in two different you know it doesn't really matter i'm gonna add in both of you add in one of you two of you basically everything that i have that makes sense right so add this oh i got i got quite a few things i'm actually very happy about this hold on okay i think i so if i have a if i have a glossy version of something the glossy version is like stored separately which makes a degree of sense i guess right um i've seen cave clash from Duel links and people don't really play it so i don't know if that's important um huh man is going to be great return once i'm to change to face on defense position okay so it might be interesting to add in like one or two of that but just looking around i'm still missing quite a bit i'm still missing quite a bit there's still quite a few things that i need or that i want to get that i just don't have yet so we need to keep on looking so from those so i still don't have a single bujin card but i think i can i can kind of start flip flop okay so flip flop frog i generate it with a with a rare okay i'm i want to try something right i want three copies of flip flop frog i haven't gotten a single copy of it yet i have a bunch of r rarity cards so can i filter out i can filter out and have just my r rarity right just r rarity and there's a bunch that i have just in abundance right i can just uh number owned like this and i can just trade out my extras right i can just i can literally trade out my extras and have more than enough to make the cards that i'm missing so i actually i, I like this let's try this out so i have eight of this i can dismantle five and still have three left over boom easy and i can keep on doing that it's actually really easy so dismantle five of this dismantle and i still have that left over beautiful and i think that gives us enough to get flip flop frog because that flip flop flip flop okay so it costs 30 30 of these points to generate it i can generate one two three and have that many left over and boom i've got flip flop frog and i just add it to my deck easily okay so this i i i i, I can i appreciate the system i actually really like the system right and i can favorite this so i can do the same thing with my sr rarity now i again i really want to play bujins but i i clearly have been ordained in the direction of sub tears so maybe i start by getting one complete deck and then go from there so i'm going to do this again but this time do it with sr confirm it's sorted by number owned so i can start with things that i have too many of right i've got too many of this dismantle two of you boom how many how many of this do i have how many how many i can actually already generate some of this hold on generate one two beautiful that's i i have i have all of them wait what i unlocked something how were the one free pull why why did i get that um save in return say why did i get a free pull why did i get it why did i get a free pull was it just the the heart of the cards on my side thank you Th thank you sir what do i get what do i get out of you that okay so i'm i'm enjoying the process of discovering this game in the future content will be more streamlined dyson sphere that's cool in the con in the future content will be more streamlined but as of right now shadow of the grenade i don't know what you are in, in uh, but but as of right now i'm kind of discovering the game and you're discovering it with me so i appreciate you being here for the ride right oh that's a, that's an sr that i can transfer beautiful that's an sr that i can transfer that's actually really good that's actually really really good okay so we go back into our deck and transfer more srs let's go Okay, so I've got three of this. Okay, I think I got that from a structure deck, so I can't do any transfers. Same with this. So cards that you got from a structure deck. Yeah, if you got it from a structure deck or it's a free card, I guess you can't dismantle it, which is fine. I have no intention of ever playing Fire Fist. And what is this? Grenade your boss fight. Okay, I, I I actually don't know if this if this archetype is any good, so I'm just gonna dismantle the two that are extra. Um and same with you. I'm gonna dismantle the one of this that's that's in excess, right? um but for fire formation i will most definitely be, be dismantling all of you this mantle um and then i can click on the sub the field spell looked really good when this card is activated you can add one sub terra monster from your deck to your hand so this is my searcher right this is a really good searcher i'm going to generate two more of this right generate two more of the field spell and add both of them to the deck we're almost at 40 cards we're almost at that 40 card sweet spot that we need um to be to be prosperous guru guru i'm pretty sure is very important for the deck right i'm pretty sure guru guru is pretty important for the deck but i don't actually know what it does 
Okay, so we're now in the realm of, of URs, right? Now we're in the realm of URs, and a lot of the URs that I have are one ofs, right? So I really have to think as to whether or not I plan on ever playing with them in order to decide whether or not I want to keep them really because like oh I, I can't actually dismantle that but Lava X Lord one tuner I don't even I don't like synchros because I don't like math when your opponent activates um, the effect of a monster on the field or in their hand destroy that monster and inflict a thousand damage huh you can better on three non fire synchro f wait what I'll keep that El Shadal I'll keep Borload I'll keep Fossil Warrior Skull King your name sounds kind of dumb your name does sound kind of dumb. I'm gonna dismantle you. I'm gonna dismantle you because it's exclusively because of how your name sounds to me. Dismantle the Fire Fist card. We're gonna dismantle one. Confirm. What else do we dismantle? No, we're, we're actually gonna generate a Guru Guru because we have enough to generate one copy of you now, right? And we add it to our deck. And then what else is in here that we don't need? Phantom of Chaos. Your opponent takes no battle damage from attacks involving this card once per turn. Target one effect monster in your graveyard, banish it. And if you do, huh? Target one effect monster in your own graveyard, banish it. Okay. And if you do, this card's name and original attack become that monster's name and original attack, replace its effect with that monster's effect. That's actually really cool. That's actually really cool. I'm going to keep that. I'm going to keep that and favorite it. What do you say? Blue Eyes Abyss Dragon. I'm not I'm not playing Blue Eyes. <laughs> I'm not going to be a Blue Eyes main. If this card is special, you can add one. Oh, wait. That actually sounds kind of good. Okay, never mind. Darkest Diablos. This is really hard. I'm going to keep it a buck 50 with you. I'm going to dismantle one of this. Okay, I've got my three Guru Gurus. I've got my three Nemesis Warriors. I've got three copies of Subterra Fiendus. So that's basically the majority of the Subterra cards that I think like are, are, are super important, but I'm still not at 40 cards yet, so I can't play the deck. Um, I guess staples. I guess we go through staples that I've obtained. Okay, so I got to, I've got some interesting stuff. I mean, I got this from, I think, a structure deck, right? Um, I've got, when you look over to the right-hand side, there's actually quite a few things that I've obtained so far that I think are cool, like at least worth favoriting. This is definitely, I've heard of Rank Up Magic, and I'm pretty sure it's important for later, so I'm going to hold on to that. Um, what else do I have? Do I, this, ooh, what does this say? At the start of your main phase one, banish three random, huh, from your extra deck, and draw oh okay yeah 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 we're adding you in you you get to stay part of extravagance okay cool so we're gonna keep part of extravagance <laughs> we're gonna put that in our deck um we don't have any fire monsters so that doesn't really matter for us um okay can ash blossom be used in any deck by the way is ash blossom I, i've never read its effect but hey i've got i've got one so i might as well i might as well see hold on ash ash what do you say when a card effect is activated that includes any of these effects, discard this card and negate it, add a card from the deck to the hand, special summon from the deck, oh, okay, so that's just a generally good card, I'm going to add that in, why not, and that puts me at 40 cards, that puts me at 40 cards, but I do want to keep on looking around, I got something called Quaking Mirror Force, which really synergizes with, it sets my opponent's monsters face down, which could be, which could be very useful, I want to try and play this at 40 cards, so I'm going, I, 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 I think, I think we're in a good spot, I think we're in, I think we found a sweet spot, I can't imagine we find any more trap cards that like really, really like scream, put me in the deck type beat, right? So we've got a healthy amount of spells, a healthy, uh, a healthy amount of traps. I've never built a TCG deck to actually like use before outside of like Yu-Gi-Oh! Omega. Uh, and even then I only ever played against the AI. Actually, no, that's not true. I played against like a few community members before without really knowing what I was doing. So this is like my first like like honest to God, I built a deck, baby's first deck. Let's go, let's go, right? Um, oh, so, so, okay, I've got, I've got Solemn Judgment, that makes sense to have, let's take this out, right, I think this is my first deck, oh, wait, an extra deck, right, I forgot, oh, my days, that was tedious, <laughs> okay, so, this is my, um, this is my first ever deck, my first ever deck that I built myself for the TCG, I can't wait to play a game or two with this, but that will be next time, that will be later, thank you very much for watching, hope you have a fantastic day, We'll catch you later.